409 on your hometown station, KHTS. I am joined in studio by someone I play basketball with like two times a week. I know him as Basketball Eddie. I don't know him as Chef Eddie, but Eddie Escobar, CEO and owner of the Go Fusion mobile food truck catering business, is in the studio in Old Town New Hall along with his girlfriend. His girlfriend, right? Eddie? Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Eddie, what's happening, dude? It's it's good to see you. It's good to see you too. Happy to be here. Thank you for inviting us. Of course. I, I know you're a little bit nervous. Just you're the bit. first <laughs> food truck business that we've had in the studio. They're all ducking us. And I think you would have ducked me too <laughs> if if we, if you didn't know me, the host. Not just that, but you know, I'm in my hometown. This is where I'm from. I live five minutes from the station and just really happy to be able to share with you guys sometime. Yeah. So now you have two of the Go Fusion and Grill food trucks. One of them is going to be on display at the Home and Garden Show, right? That's correct. And what kind of food do you guys serve at the Go Fusion and Grill food truck? We have something very unique, Asian, Mexican, American food, and it's just got a little bit for everybody. A little bit for everyone. Teriyaki tacos, quesadilla burgers, carne asada, fries, and uh, another truck as well for healthier options. Exactly. We have Go Beyond the Bowl that will have great options if you eat fish, poke. We do fish tacos as well. And we also have vegetarian and vegan options for people out there. How did you start making the poke? Because you've been in the restaurant business for a little bit now, right? Yes, I have. How would well, you start? I started back in the oof, when I was 16 years old, and you know it was a lot of fun working around food, and I just realized that there was something there for me, so I just kept growing and growing into different like management positions, and then eventually I knew that it was time for me to start my own business. I wanted to put all my culinary arts out there and show the world what I can do. What is the most popular item between the two food trucks? Carne asadas, for sure. Carne really? Carne asada, french fries. We always use fresh potatoes. We use black Angus steak, and we have a little bit of spiciness to it, a little bit of sweetness to it with uh, lots of cilantro and onions that give it that freshness as well. Now, your girlfriend is in studio right now. She's taking your picture as I speak. <laughs> she is the inspiration behind uh, you adding pokey and some healthier options, right? Exactly. Her and I have always shared a lot of time going out to restaurants and you know, she always looked for the healthiest thing, finding all the poke options at restaurants. And I just got really inspired and I figure I'm going to make some poke for her and I'm going to give it my own twist. And of course, she loved it after that. And, you know, it feels like there's a lot of inspiration behind her with a third food truck that we have in the works. Not only the food in the food trucks, but a healthier lifestyle as is. Exactly. The girlfriend. Non-GMO, organic. Non-GMO, organic. Kind of what we're looking for. You know, I was on the website a little bit earlier, and if you want to go check it out, it's gotruckscatering.com. And the pictures, the food gallery from both of these trucks is amazing. The food and the picture quality are just excellent. Did you have? Did you set up the photo shoots? <laughs> With this set up, I made most of the food that is in those pictures. And, you know, when I was looking at it, I wanted to make sure it looked just as good as it tastes. But I definitely recommend everybody to come and try it because it's definitely way better when you have it and you taste it. So you're going to have two of the food trucks, the Go Fusion and Grill food trucks, which teriyaki tacos, quesadilla burgers, carne asada, fries, basically everything that you can ever imagine fusing together is going to be at that food truck. And from cucumber salads and grilled soy veggies to teriyaki nach nachos and pokey burritos. Eddie and his team got it all at the Go Beyond the Bowl food truck, which will be on display in all its glory at the 10th annual KHTS Home and Garden Show, April 27th and 28th at Central Park. You can browse the menu, check out their food gallery, which we lauded a little bit earlier, and even book them for catering, charity and corporate events, private parties, festivals, and more. You're a busy man, Eddie. Yes, I am. The schedule is jam-packed. Yes, You're booked it is. by like Amazon, Netflix, Drew Barrymore is reaching out to you. You're a humble guy, but uh, very busy, very successful. I never knew this was part of your persona. Besides basketball, I'm also a pretty good chef. Are you playing tonight? Because we play on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Are, will you be playing tonight? I will definitely be there. And Eddie, his collection of jerseys is incredible. <laughs> it is. What jersey are we rocking tonight? Tonight, I probably will go with the old school Pippen Chicago Bulls jersey. Really? Oh, yes, sir. Not the Allen Iverson Nuggets jersey. That's my favorite. <laughs> Not the one tonight. Thank That's you. Thank That's my favorite you. of the LeBron, collection. My favorite Lakers well. aren't doing too well. No, no, no. <laughs> have to put that one. Uh, go Trucks Catering.com. Go Trucks Catering.com. Eddie, thanks for coming in. We'll Thank see you at you the Home and Garden Show, and I'll see you tonight. Thank you. We'll see you then. 414 on your own town station, KHTS. Time for a quick break. Stay tuned. More music coming up.